During this screencast, I'll be giving you a quick introduction to Mapature Pro, Ubermind's latest Aperture plugin. With Mapature Pro, you can easily add geotags either manually or automatically from track logs taken with GPS devices, as well as reverse geocode GPS coordinates and embed this data to your images without ever having to leave Aperture. On my Mac, I've already installed Mapature Pro, and I have Aperture up and running. I'll begin by selecting a few photos I took in California around the Apple campus that I like to geotag. Then I'll either go to the Images menu or right-click on the Image selection and select Edit with Mapperture Pro. This opens Mapperture Pro and takes me right to my hometown by default. If I had opened the plugin with images that had been previously geotagged, it would have taken me to that location. This can be changed by opening the Preferences and choosing your default map location from the drop-down menu. You can also set Mapperture Pro to automatically reverse geocode your images with various information when you geotag them. I'll go ahead and enable this. If I had previously entered information in these IPTC fields, if I click the Do Not Overwrite checkbox, it would leave this information untouched. Custom keywords can also be added when geotagging with Mapperture Pro. By default, there is no keyword assigned, so I'll enable this option to enter one now. The image browser displays all the selected images and allows me to choose which image or images I want to work with at the moment. In the Maps section, I can navigate, zoom, and change viewing modes using the default Google Maps interface or the custom aqua controls available under the Preferences. This first photo was taken at the Apple campus, so I'll search for that address and locate the exact spot that I shot it. The search bar also stores your recent searches for future use. Now when I click a spot on the map, a pin is added to mark this image's location and a badge is added to the thumbnail to indicate it will be geotagged. If I click on this pin, I can see the specific latitude, longitude, altitude, and location information that has been set for this image. Another way to show this information is to right-click the thumbnail in the image browser and select Show Location Info. This is also helpful if you lose track of your image on the map as it will center the map to its location. You can also do this without displaying the location information by just double-clicking on the image thumbnail in the browser. If I want to reposition this pin, I can simply pick it up and drop it in another spot. Notice how the location information has changed in the info pop-up. The plugin processes my images and when it's finished, returns me back to Aperture. Now if I select the image I just edited, you can see the latitude, longitude, altitude, and location information by viewing its metadata. This image has been geotagged as well as reverse geocoded due to the settings we enabled prior. In addition to adding new geotags, Mapperture Pro also allows you to update the location information of photos that have already been geotagged. You'll notice that a few markers have already been placed on the map. If I want to change their location, I simply move the marker as I would for any one on the map. Multiple images can be geotagged with the same location at once by making a custom selection with either the shift or command keys. Now, if I wanted to manually reverse geocode any of these images, simply make your selection by using either shift or command, then right-click the image selection in the upper browser and select reverse geocode from the contextual menu. You'll see a processing animation at the bottom of the plugin showing you it's working. After I'm satisfied with the location for my photos, I'll click Save and store the new geotag and reverse geocoding information. Now I'll show you how to import your track log data file into Mapperture Pro. This allows for automatic geotagging from your GPS device's recorded information. First, you'll need to extract the track log from your GPS device into a readable format with a utility like Load My Tracks or GPS Babel. Next, select the images you would like to geotag with the track log and then launch the plugin. Now click the gear drop-down menu and select Import Track Log. From the Finder window, navigate to your track log file and click Import. The plugin processes the points in the track log and displays a summary screen. You may choose between matching styles as well as time offset to make sure as many images are matched as possible. To update the number of matching images, click on the Match Images button. When you're satisfied with the settings, click the Set Locations from Track Log button. As you can see by the results, several pins are placed on the map to their closest GPS coordinates based on the timestamps in the track log and the image files. This can be a huge time saver when geotagging large groups of images. Mapperture Pro also has some new functionality that greatly improves its ease of use. One of these new features is the ability to store location bookmarks. To store a bookmark, click on the pin or image thumbnail you'd like to save, then click on the bookmarks drop-down and select Add Bookmark. Give it a name and click Add. These can be applied to one or several images as well. Copy and paste of GPS location data is another new feature. To copy a location from one to another, simply right-click on the thumbnail and select Copy Location. Then right-click on the image you would like to paste it to and select Paste Location. 
And if you so desire, you can remove the location data from all your images found by clicking the gear dropdown. I'm not going to do that at this point, because from the badges on the thumbnails I can tell that all my images have been geotagged, so I'll go ahead and save that information into Aperture. After I've added location information to my photos, this data can be used in a variety of ways. Aperture, for instance, now has the option to show an image on a map. If I were to export this image with the GPS metadata embedded and upload it to a service like Picasso Web Albums, this location data would allow other users to see where this photo was shot. In fact, any service or program that is designed to make use of geotags can now benefit from this data being stored within my images. With Mapature Pro from Ubermind, adding geotags to your photos just became another simple step in your photography workflow.